Hey guys, Crux in the Clouds here coming back at you with another review video. Um, as I promised, I'm going to be reviewing the Funnel Bowl. Um, interesting story though, I had a review set up for this yesterday. It just hadn't uploaded it yet. And then when I started to smoke, I decided to try something. Because my last review, the smoke wasn't really thick. It was pretty thin. Um, but... I tried something different with setting it up, and I got a lot better effect, so I'm just showing you guys how honest I am. You know, if there's, as I said, I saw some, I got different effects by doing this different thing, which I will tell you about, but after I saw that I could get better smoke, I threw my last review out, because, well, if I prove myself wrong, I'm not going to upload a review that's not. 100% accurate. So, that's why I'm doing basically a take two. Um, I said that um, this is the Chinese funnel bowl. It's not a Tangier's funnel bowl. Um, like most people have. I got it for $11 at Hookah Dash Shisha. But anyway, here's the bowl. As you can see, I have three coals on it, um, and that's what I did to get it better. Is in the initial heating session, you want if you're using like small coals, you're going to want to use um, an extra charcoal. Well, you're going to want to use an extra charcoal either way. With small coals, you're going to want to use three charcoals. With big coals, um, you're going to want to use two or at least, break, if you can, break the ch one big charcoal in half, set aside, and then take another half of another charcoal and put it on there. But yeah, you need to use an extra charcoal when initially heating it. But as you can see, now I'm getting good clouds. And as I said last night, my last review, they weren't they weren't that great. So, as I said, just to show you guys how honest I am, I saw that I can get better quality out of it by adding an extra coal. So, that's why I'm doing another review, even though I had a review last night, because I wasn't going to post a review that wasn't 100% honest. Um, but anyway, with that, as to what I think about the bowl... Um, I really like it. I like the fact, and it's a great concept, and instead of, like, if you don't know what a funnel bowl is, instead of it having a bunch of holes on the bottom, like traditional bowls have, there's a little tower-like structure in the center that has a one big hole. And basically what that does is you pack the shisha around it, and one, it keeps the juices in, so you get full lasting flavor, which I'm a good 50 minutes into this session, so... I'm definitely getting, you know, it's definitely still maintaining the flavor very well. And also, um, the fact is with the centerpiece, you don't get the juices going down in your stem, which makes cleaning a lot more easier and a lot less problematic. Um, one thing that surprised me, though, is... I said, here's the bowl again on top. And you can pack a really good amount of shisha. And the reason why that surprised me is this is advertised as their small Chinese funnel bowl. Which, for a small bowl, you can pack a real good amount of shisha in there. So I don't even, want, I don't even know how big the standard size funnel bowl is. But anyway... What I like and what I don't like about it, I like, you know, it makes cleanup easier. I like that it maintains the flavor longer. The only thing I got to say I don't like is the fact you have to use an extra coal to get it heated. You don't have to use an extra coal on the second round, but still, 
the fact that you have to use an extra coal to heat it, or if you're using a big coal, you have to break, you have to try to break it in half or something so you can get it all, you can keep the coals on the sides because you don't want anything hot above the centerpiece. Um, that's, it makes it a little more of a task heating the bowl than you would with a standard. But besides all that, but besides that, I really like it. Um, and also, I think it's a great aesthetic piece. I think it adds a little extra umps to any hookah you put it on. And, you know, a lot of hookah smokers were about aesthetics when it comes to accessories for our hookahs. Um, <clears throat> sorry, I'm saying um a lot. <laughs> but anyway, this has been Crux in the Clouds coming at you with the Chinese Funnel Bowl review. You guys have a good day.